I greet you in Jesus' precious name. It is Wednesday morning. It's the 14th of February, 2024. And this is your friend, Angus Bucken, with a thought for the day. We start off in the book of Isaiah, chapter 40, and I'm reading verse 28. Have you not known, have you not heard the everlasting God the Lord, the creator of the ends of the earth, neither faints nor is weary. His understanding is unsearchable. Wow. <laughs> he doesn't rest. He's awake. He's waiting to hear you this morning, my dear friend. And then we go straight to the book of Romans, chapter 11, and I'm reading verse 34. For who has known the mind of the Lord? Or who has become his counselor? Or who has first given to him and it shall be repaid to him? We can't give him anything. We can't give him anything. He is God. No one, not even Albert Einstein, can know the mind of Christ. Now this Lord, this God, our God, he has a plan for you and he has a plan for me. He says in 1 Corinthians chapter 2 and verse 9, I has not seen, nor ear heard, nor have entered into the heart of man the things which God has prepared for those who love him. What a beautiful promise. I remember as a young 15-year-old boy in central Zambia, a place called Kitwe, I remember sitting on an anthill as a young boy, and I used to dream of preaching to multitudes of people about my Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. Oh, folks, it has happened. Yes, more than once. Please, today, do not limit God. Dream your dream. He did it, and He still is for me, and He can do it for you too. Have a wonderful day. Jesus bless you, and goodbye.